Hi and welcome to my bathroom, wet shave lovers. Today we're gonna try a soap called um, Taliban Steel West India. It's a soap sample sent to me by Connie Magnusson, a member of the Swedish wet shaving group on Facebook. And it's one of his favorite soaps, so it will be very interesting to see what I think about that soap. Um, I have it here already whipped up in my scuttle. It's quite a strong scent, above medium. And there are really nice notes here. I can't uh, identify them all. But it's um, some kind of citrus, maybe orange or lemon or both and there's definitely tobacco here and there's some woody scents as well in the back it's a very warm peppery scent this one really pleasant and it leathers up very well it's an artisan soap and um, cost around 25 dollars for four ounces um, before I start, I can inform that the soap I used in my previous video, the Panna Crema, it was supposed to work as a post shave. Instead of using a balm, you could use nothing and uh, just have washed off the soap, of course, and then let it be. And I did that, and I must say I had a great post shave feeling from that soap. Fantastic soap. Something to keep in mind if you're gonna buy that one because it's quite an expensive soap as you definitely don't need any aftershave balm using that soap. It nourished the, the skin very well, that ingredients in that soap, so it was really great. Um, I will go with my slim adjustable today. And I have the Kai blade in there. It's the sixth use of that one. It's a record for me. Let's see if it will be sharp today and give a smooth shave or not. I will be very surprised if it doesn't start to tug. And I will finish off with uh, Mule Sandalwood of the Shave Balm. And I'm gonna smell very good with Aromis Classic EDT because I'm going to the physiotherapist today at one o'clock and I want to smell good there who knows what can happen there no. okay so I'm gonna wet my face and we can start this up I just washed my face with soap, soap before because I'm not allowed to shower yet for a few days. I still have a special dressing over my wound. So it's quite difficult to keep the hygiene as it should be. This soap contains um, essential oils only, and tallow. I already feel this um, nice sensation on the face. That's good soaps usually show this special feeling immediately when you put it on. You can probably take a lot of water as well. I think it's a Canadian soap. Handmade artisan soap. A 
actually I uh, now when I uh, hope for life again I actually pull the trigger and order the La Paglosian Rose de Pushka soap from their website and it was quite tricky because uh, some French I uh, used the Google Translate but really soap makers out there it's t year 2018 you must have a English website it's not the 18th century anymore it must be easier to understand and in that way you sell more soaps yourself and increase your business how hard can it be I'm gonna go with the first pass a bit thicker Jesus this ladder is great and see how slick it is my towels here a little bit bear with me okay the sixth use of the cow blade with the grain on settings nine I also want to thank you all for commenting on my last video. Uh, it was very heartwarming to see all the congratulations you gave me. Thank you very much guys. It's no uh, almost no residual slickness here now, but the glide is there when you shave. But as you saw, I had quite a thick dense leather. I like to start the first pass like that to get the feeling for the soap and then make it a lot wetter in the second pass. First pass down. Seems like I don't need a brush for second pass, I can only do it like this. But I will do anyway. Use the brush. Now it's a lot wetter. <coughs> Hope you're all okay out there, guys. Midweek already.
it's actually very I'm very amazed over this community we have here and how wonderful people there really is out there supporting each other I can tell you I got more support from you guys than from my work and it says it all I think I got a few colleagues that cared and many that I uh, thought should have cared but they are not even called me and that's good to know who they are. I sound a bit bitter, and actually I am. But pay no attention to that because it has nothing to do with this, really. But it's just a reflection of what can happen to you in the life. Anything can happen, and uh, then you can see who your friends really are. And that's quite an important lesson. I must say the residual slickness is um, not much to write home about. However, with a little bit of water, there's no problem to dry shave at all, as you can see. So this soap, you should um, whip up to the wet side, absolutely, if you I think residual slickness is very important for you. But uh, it's no problem because the glide is there. Amazingly enough, this blade still keeps up. It starts to get a little bit Tuggy maybe, but it's the sixth use of my coarse beer, so it's nothing strange. I will probably be in this play today, but uh, it's good value for the money because the carry blade is quite expensive. It's uh, if you can get five, six shaves of the blade, it's a very reasonable. Great shave. I love the sound of this soap. It's very powerful. If you use this one, you can tell me what kind of spice it is. I cannot identify this warm pepper scent. Or if it's some kind of woody notes, I don't know really. It's, it's, a, it's a very warm spicy scent. It's not the traditional sandalwood. No. 
I think I'm happy so guys. I'm just gonna rinse and I'll be back. It was a great soap. Uh, I could not wash it away. It gave this uh, thin layer of slickness on my face and it's probably something very good because it contains vitamin E and things like that. Uh, different kinds of oils that are good for skin, organ oil, I think it was inside it too. And um, it will probably be very, very good. But it's a soap you can use a lot of water. Mule sandalwood of the shame bone. So you can use a lot of water whipping that up or on your face because you can take it and it will probably perform even better. It was a very, very good soap. One of the better. Definitely a premium soap. Both in the sound wise and um, how it performed. So it's a soap you cannot go wrong with. Um, have you used it? So please let me know what you think about it. Now we're gonna smell very good today. Strong and good and masculine. Like that. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. And please comment below if you want to say something. I appreciate that. You know that. Take care everyone. Bye-bye.